Hey, hey everybody, this is not a spring chick as you can tell. We are on set, but here's one thing. It's holiday season, and what else is in season right now? Oh, Obamacare. Okay, so the president happens to be out promoting Obamacare. Oh, oh wait, wait, no, the affordable health care plan, again, for the 117th? 71st. 71st? He's making a wow. 171st trip to promote something. Wow. That's almost like half a year. Yeah. I mean, can you believe that? Well... Um, anyway, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. Look at that. <laughs> you can stay there, Monty. And it's all over for the Republicans. Yeah, well, the, they said that the, the, the people are going to love Obamacare so much by, and se by the year 2017, they'll be grateful for what has been done. <laughs> it, it, was, it was supposed to be next year. And then 2016. Now it's 2017. 2017 is when you don't your exemptions cut out, and you have to pay for it all yourself. So, I love she's. I love how you know she's a totally blind dog and just loves to walk through everything. Oh my place. gosh! Did yeah. you see that? She goes through the tripod leg, goes around the table, and underneath hits nothing, and there's no additional space. Oh. She never touches anything. When and she there's only touch. like, what, a half an inch on each side, maybe? Yeah. At the she, most? She, <laughs> she's a very unique blind dog. I know. And Obamacare, you can trust us on this, but you probably won't. Yeah, I mean, the, uh, they love that one. They said that uh, you uh, everything we tell you is the truth. And, okay, one of the guys, uh, I, I'm listening to like William Shatner on one of the episodes, she said, I'm a habitual liar. That means everything I tell you is a lie, and and it, th therefore, since everything I tell you is a lie, it's a lie that everything I tell you is a lie. So therefore, everything I tell you must be the truth, but they can't be the truth because I told you I'm a habitual liar. That's what they're. Um, I mean, they, the Democrats—they're going to run heavily on Obamacare. Yeah, like there's 14 United States senators that are trying to avoid it. Mm -hmm. And the Democrats plan to run on the success stories of Obamacare. They can't find any success stories. They, you go. Here's a good one. You give someone something for nothing that they didn't have to pay for it before to begin with. That's not a success story. They have the stories like, well, I'm sorry, but you're. You can't, this program does not cover your 18-month-old child. Uh -huh. You're going to have to have a separate one. Or, well, we're sorry, you're not covered, you're, uh, you know, they're supposed to be covering all of the, the pre-existing, well, we can't cover the medicine for your cancer, so you're going to have to pay for that on your own. Or, we're sorry that uh, your, uh, your, your health care bill mm -hmm. will now be $6,000 a year when it was only $1,000 a year before. Those, they said there, right now there's at least... Uh, Seven million failures and almost no successes. Where anybody, okay, nobody that has to pay for it, is it has come forth and said how great it is. And uh, Amazon unveils a futuristic mini drone delivery plan. The aardvark Obama says, he said, I realized that I'm a pink aardvark, and I was actually meant to be a bunny, but my face got wrong. He said that. <laughs> no, he said. Uh, he said. You know that uh, you see Elmer Fudd with his shotgun shooting at that rascally rabbit and not aardvarks? He said, Get, just wait till those little drones start coming over your house. Kids with little slingshot. <laughs> yeah, that's all it's got. To, I love to see those. You know, a, they want to have a, a million of them on, in, in, in use very shortly. And the U.S. Navy deploys new surveillance aircraft to Japan. Yeah, because they, they basically, Obama's trying to look tough. At the same time, he's telling the Japanese to build your own defense force, which is in violation of the, uh, of the terms of peace that were signed, which they're getting flack from. No, we have a degree, they have a treaty. They are not to have a military attack force. They can only have a minor defense force. Now Obama says, build a full military again. Oh, he does? Yeah. And global carbon emissions rise to a new record in 2013, report. Yeah, because uh, what people don't understand is that China and India and, and, uh, and African countries have no intentions of reducing carbon emissions. Uh, so if they're pumping this stuff out, uh, anyway, Aardvark has said one very important thing. You realize that most of the carbon crap in the air this year is from all the volcanic activity, not from industry? Mm -hmm. And he said, where did you find this out? Oh, 
I actually watched public broadcasting and they got a great thing about global warming, how the majority of it is caused by forces of nature, not by man. Mm -hmm. And then Yahoo slams the rush to accommodate Iran. Well, it, 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 this is got to be the most god-awful stupid thing you ever heard of. Well, we slowed them down. Um, yeah, what you did was you give them six months to rebuild their, their economy and then they, they, they don't give up anything. They just don't put a bomb out for one month after, you know, instead of having the bomb next month, they have it later this fall, spring, I guess, yeah. And Netanyahu slant, oh, well, actually, could volcanoes be causing the Antarctic ice loss? Because they're heating up the world. That's what happened. You realize that they said one volcano puts more emissions into the air and heats up the atmosphere more than all of the automobiles do in a year. One volcano, and uh, what was it? One of them went off again. Oh, Mount Vesuvius went off this week. Mm -hmm. It, it did? Yep, went off this week again. In some states, gays fight for the right to divorce. Yeah, oh, it seems that they didn't put divorce, uh, the ability to divorce in their, their <laughs> little gay rights legislation. That if you get married, you cannot get out of your marriage. I thought anybody that got married could get divorced. Uh, because they are giving them a special exemption. They are, they're, the marriage laws are very specific on divorces. Uh, since there is no law covering uh, the, the law for mar gay marriage only is a statute it is not actually oh. a law and so they're not providing that's right because the typical one it says a marriage is between a man and a woman and uh, those are it the says, laws what <laughs> happened was was the state legislatures wanted to cater to a minority group so they passed new statutes and a statute doesn't have the same weight as a real law does because if they actually do a real law Basically, it has to be in their constitution. It has to be done by a vote of the people, not by an act of Congress. Oh. These people are stuck. They, they're finding out, boy, that was not what we planned. <laughs> they, they found out all the <laughs> benefits, like yeah. pay more taxes. Um, more Americans spend less on Black Friday sales. Yeah, it was a total disaster. They had a, a record amount. What happened is... When the weather turns bad, especially in California, people go into the malls. They it doesn't don't mean go, they go shopping. They don't go shopping. They just don't. Whatever it is, they pull into some place rather than drive on the roads anymore. Mm -hmm. And uh, because most people, like in California, we discovered uh, two years ago from a, from a CAP officer, you know, from a state police officer in Utah, I think that California tires. You can't drive with them up here, guy. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. And you can't crane protesters dig in the hills and the Prime Minister condemns the signs of the coup. Oh, yeah, because uh, what happens is uh, he's basically a hardline Soviet and he uh, wants to turn the country back to the Soviet world and away from Europe again. Mm -hmm. And they want, they don't like, you know, they, they want to have the things from Europe, they don't want to have the things from Russia. And New York educator argues against the Common Core. Because it's ridiculous. It's meant to, what it is, it, it, uh, uh, it basically talks about how racist everybody is how black America is suffering and uh, condemns everybody that's white. That's that's the way Common Core is, folks. Mm -hmm. And U.S. ship Cape Ray ready for possible chemical arms destruction. Mm -hmm. uh, the reason why they're doing it is because nobody wants to get involved with going into a war zone to do something. And the very fact that uh, uh, if I was a terrorist, I think I'd wait till that ship was totally filled full of... Uh, Toxic of, of, of material, of poison gas, and then sink the ship. And guess what they've done? Mm -hmm. to the, and who do you think they'll blame that on? Mm -hmm. The United States, because of any person would have. Okay, they said. Well, the guy said this morning, Obama and his people are all academics. They mm -hmm. basically don't understand what happens if something goes wrong. You basically pollute the entire Mediterranean Sea for who knows how long. Ooh. Yeah. They weren't thinking about that. They don't think about things. And secret labyrinth of tunnels under Rome mapped. Uh-oh. Aardvark says, um, have you ever watched a show, a historical show, or something like Gladiator, or any of those things, the movies? The whole cruddy place is honeycombed with tunnels. The labyrinths of Rome are famous. You go, they have tourists. They've been talking about that for years. Yeah, but they just discovered it. It's just like... How did they just discover it? Oh, they just... Did, no, somebody... On one of the uh, cable channels, it discovered that there are labyrinths under Rome. Ooh, and a Monty bubble isn't for the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Oh, okay, uh, 
the, the, no matter how hard you try, the past is always there to come back and hunt you. <laughs>